Good day fine people, a very warm welcome to you. My name is Nick, we're on the Atari 2600 and we're playing a football game, believe it or not. This one's called Pele's Soccer, published by Atari in 1981, although it was renamed a year later to Championship Soccer due to copyright, so I guess they didn't have Pele's permission. Naughty them, it was a different time. Now there's 54 different modes in this, 27 single player variations and 27 two players. I'm the only player here, so I'm putting it on number 28. Uh, the um, the difficulty, well, the setting uh, varies the speed, the goal size, and the game length. Now, I hope you can make uh, sense of this. I'm the three brown characters, yes. It's free aside football, two defenders and a striker. I'm kicking up. The time is ticking down in the middle, and we're kicking around this square ball. The goalkeeper is automatic. That's controlled by the computer. Um, we're not really staying in any positions. It's just free things going up and down to try and simplify it as quickly as uh, well as easy as possible go 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 now my fear my fear is uh, it's going to be nil nil here but anyway going towards the goal if you had this one back in the day let me know it's incredible they've even attempted it shoot oh the goalkeeper saved the uh, thing yes yeah, so uh, Pele soccer renamed championship soccer because probably a complaint by Pele's PR people now come on someone score a goal nil nil my score's on the left the computer's on the right Come on, let's get hold of it, boot it up the field. These reviews, you probably know this already, these reviews aren't about expert gameplay. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, no. They're about how you would have found the game on your first or second go. Always a little bit difficult to comment and play at the same time, as it quite often comes across. And uh, would you have gone back to play the game? Now, I can't think of any other football games on the Atari 2600, but you'll probably tell me. But it's doing quite a good job. I don't think you could expect it. Oh, no. I don't think you could expect it. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Fireworks show. You couldn't expect it more than like 11 aside or anything like that. So, free aside works quite well in our sort of like a triangle formation. Right, 1-0. Can I get a goal in this? At least someone scored. Oh, this is a chance. Boot it, big nose. Now, I think the longer you hold down the fire button for releasing it is the more powerful the shot. There's not, oh, there's not too many variations. I am peppering their goal now. So I hope I'm getting used to it. Now, this is the uh, the slowest speed, I think, and the largest goal to try and give yourself a chance. But, you know, the last goal, it makes it easier for the computer to score as well. Oh, come on, Nick, just boot it up. Pele is probably the most successful um, World Cup star of all time. He's from Brazil, if you didn't know. He played in four World Cups. First won the World Cup uh, when he was 17. Imagine that, scoring six goals. But he did play in four World Cups and won three of them. Absolutely incredible. I myself have won no World Cups, unless one I've, uh, you count the few I've won on kickoff two on the Amiga. 34 seconds. It's a game of two halves. It always is. Um, I, I'm quite impressed with this. It, it isn't really football, is it? It's just uh, three blobs running up and down with a square ball trying to see who can score the most goals. But, uh, you know, apart from that, it's good. Right, come on, is this a chance now? Buff it. Yes! Yeah, goal! Well, 1-1. One, one. So the review's a success. I've scored a goal. Let's see if I can get the winner. 54 different difficulties. It'd be great fun uh, with a um, uh, human player playing it back in the day. That'd been quite nice. Uh, you can't actually play a World Cup, so you can't go through a championship. It's just, um, well, friendlies, more or less, uh, one against the other. Uh, a World Cup would have been good, but might be a bit too powerful for the uh, Tai 2600 to handle. Not sure what else Pele Soccer come out on, but uh, it's from my mind. It's the only game that's got Pele sort of like in there, and it wasn't a proper license. Oh dear, well his name's on the front cover as well. If, if, he, if they didn't even speak to him at all, that's extremely naughty by Atari. But it's back in a different day where I suppose they thought they could do anything. Boot it! Oh, the goalkeeper's not coming out. The goalkeeper can't come off his line in this one. Right, just get rid of it, folks. When you've got the ball, you do run slower than the attacking team chasing you. Good, good, good. This is quite hectic. It's football. Oh, there's probably a set way of scoring every time in this thing. Oops, just got onto there. So there's no uh, pitch markings here. There's no crowd noise. Oh, two defenders, one striker in a perfect... They move in unison like a synchronised swimming team. They're in perfect unison as they try and get a goal. So I presume uh, the weird Brazil, the brown ones, the blue ones, are just any other random team in the world. Italy, San Marino, Stamford Lee Hope. One of those teams. Come on. 
on, or uh, quite close to me is Billy Ricky Big Boys. I might have made that team up. Here we go down the pitch. Come on. As you can see, uh, you can't knock the ball out of play for throw-ons. It will just ricochet off the uh, the uh, the wall there. So it's more or less we're playing indoor soccer. So it's indoor soccer, free as indoor free aside soccer, World Cup stuff. You know that game. I don't think Pele ever played dead, but he's sort of like renowned as one of the greatest players of all time. Yeah, he's got a few goals. I think he's Brazil, Brazil's, someone might correct me if I'm wrong, I think he might still be Brazil's international top goal scorer of all time. There's been a few uh, like players for them, Ronaldo and, and Ronaldinho and Socrates and um, someone else. Uh, they've been pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good success rate, Brazil. I think they've won it the most times. What's, what's this team doing? They're dance, dancing around the ball. I've never played football with a square football. If you have, let me know. How did you get on? Did it take some unnatural bounces? The pitch is always the same, so you ain't got a bumpy pitch or a soggy pitch or plastic like kickoff two. The only thing that changes with the the, uh, the different settings is the size of the goal. Whee! Great goal! 2-1. The only thing that changes is the size of the goal and the speed, the speed that the thing plays at. 2-1. Well, I've just got to hold on now for 30 seconds. That's great! So on the easiest setting then, I'm not doing too bad. These views about your first go. There's a first go. I'm doing great. Two goals. Good stuff. Can I get a third goal? No. Seems like you need to run in close and then shoot at 45 degrees. Don't try and shoot too far away, though. My second goal was quite good, wasn't it? Keep going. Good advice. They're trying to get it out. They've got it to their striker, but we're keeping them, we're keeping them penned in here, folks. Come on, you Browns. Woof. 2-1. You know, first ever go. Went 1-0 down, come back with two goals. That's pretty special stuff. If you're liking the Atari 2600 stuff, we've reviewed quite a few, so check out the playlist, click on my username. Uh, let's, let's get this on the most uh, uh, hardest uh, one now. Yes, click on my username, get to the channel page, and then click on playlist, and the Atari 2600 will be there, and the number of us is 54. So, it should... Oh, it's moving oh, It's moving a lot quicker now. And apparently the... Go oh, God, this is too tricky. And apparently the, uh, the goals are a lot smaller. Was that a goal? Why did they score there? Well, it's 1 0 already. I don't know how my goalkeeper didn't save that. But the fireworks go off again. I hope they've got a lot of fireworks in reserve here because uh, I could be going quite a few goals down. We might not be playing the full game on this one because I think I've pretty much told you a lot how the game plays, whether you want to track it down or not. But yeah, play it. Oh man, play it on the easiest mode first. Come on, Nick. Go, go up the field. Come on, let's get a fluke. Go, oh dear. It's very hard to get behind the ball and dribble with it, possibly because it looks like a sugar lump. Oh, they've taken a pot shot there, but they're they're peppering it. It's bouncing. It's not going for a goal kick. It's just bouncing off a wall. It's like almost as like he's trying to save the ball from going in his garage. Oh, come on, team. Let's get back. We can't get it out. Oh, look. This is this is harassment. This surely you can't crowd the goalkeeper like this. We're stuck down here. Just hoof it up the field. Hoof it. We need some goal hang up the other end, like a, a Gary Lineker or Michael Owen or Andy Cole used to do that. I I, I don't. I, I think this this level is a bit too tricky for me. I need to get it on the easiest level again. Right, let's see. It's only one nil though. Well, it's one nil down. There's always a chance. Oh, look at this. Uh, they're gonna they're gonna get a second goal I think at any point. If you are Pele, comment below uh, with your tips. I think Pele at time of oh man at time of recording I think Pele is 81 now. Two nil. I 81, but that's still younger than some of my players from Player Manager on the Commodore Amiga when I was in about my well well. well my, my like 100th season or something like that where you just didn't retire as the player manager it was ridiculous times 2-0 go go just keep hold of the ball go go we're there they're following us shoot oh I didn't even have a shot on goal then but I got quite close that's promising just goes to show you I have quite a few goes I might get a bit better so it's got a good learning curve on this it's quite kind to the newbie um, it's not like different buttons for lob and shoot and stuff, just the length of time you've got on the fire button. Uh, tackling, well just get into the ball and press fire button and hope for the best. Uh, sometimes your players can get stuck on the side. Oh, 3-0. I think, I think that we're going to leave it there. 
Well, I think we're just going to gradually go away. But I like this. Uh, 1981, I would have played it loads. 82 could have been Championship Soccer, but a real good, solid game on the Chytrix 600. I can really recommend that for a good retro soccer, early 80s buzz. So, hope you liked having a look at that one. That was Pele Soccer, published by Atari in 1981, renamed Championship Soccer in 1982. If you've got any comments about this game, similar games, or anything retro, then please put that below. You're always more than welcome, and I love reading your comments. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.